doing? We're arm wrestling to see who gets your room. Now, y'all, she's a little girl. <laughs> You're hurting me. Oh, I'm sorry. Ow! Sucker! <laughs> Meanwhile, you're so busy designing who gets my room. Where am I supposed to sleep? Well, Fran, once you're married, you're moving with Daddy. Oh, my God. This just keeps getting better and better. <laughs> Oh, there's my adorable new roommate now. Mm, morning, darling. You know, sweetie, last night you didn't give me that little something that I'm used to getting from you every week. Oh, Fran, since we got engaged, I didn't think I had to give it to you anymore. Wait a minute. I know what I'm talking about. What are you talking about? Your paycheck. Oh, thank God. That's what I'm talking about, too. <laughs> But, honey, even though we're getting married, I still want to work. We have always been a two-income family. Yes, dear, but your income always came out of my income. I still want to have a career. I don't want to be one of those wives that just sits around having lunch with the girls or shopping or, or getting their hair done. All right, well, you know what? Maybe I'll try it for a couple of weeks. <laughs> that down. It's plaster. You want to scrape your esophagus again? <laughs> Miss Fine, Mrs. Fine, welcome, uh, welcome. Hi. I'm Dirk, your wedding coordinator, and may I say we are honored that you selected us for the Fine Sheffield reception. Mm. It's truly the wedding of the century. Uh, well, it took nearly that long to happen. <laughs> Now, Dirk, I just want to tell you, Oz is a mixed marriage. He's from drinkers, we're from eaters, so let's plan the menu accordingly. Oh, fun, fun, funny, fun, fun. <laughs> now, may I suggest, as your guests arrive, we wow them with an ice sculpture of the Trevi Fountain. Oh, a fountain sounds nice, but can they make it out of chopped liver? Oh, challenge, <laughs> challenge, challenge. I love it. I love it. Okay, now, we have over 75 hors d'oeuvres to choose Ooh. from. Now, would you like to taste them, or would you trust me taste. to choose them? Okay. <laughs> I see stumped. I see stumped. Oh. <clears throat> uh, I'm working with a new person, forgive me. <laughs> Look at me, I'm like Regis without Kathy Lee. <laughs> <laughs> Ma, you know, I have a little problem I need to talk to you about. Mr. Sheffield doesn't want me to work anymore. And the conundrum would be... <laughs> I mean, it's not as if I'm not going to be busy enough performing my wifely duties, and God knows I've had that stored up for five years. <laughs> <laughs> Who's going to have the energy to work? <laughs> but still, I want to feel like I contribute something to the marriage. Oh, sure you will. You're his partner in life. You're the woman behind the man. Help him, support him, be there for him. Never refuse him. You get me? Yeah, I get you. You're talking about dinner, right? <laughs> what else is there? <sighs> now, would it be too presumptuous to ask about the releasing of the doves? Oh, no doves. There's no meat on them. <laughs>